See, I just hate a brain fart. <laughs> Girl. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Clark. I do videos on luxury lifestyle and fashion. If there's something that you're interested in, go ahead and subscribe. And if you're already turned subscriber, girl, thank you so much for tuning back in. So, girls, I just did a video on the top three SOGs in my collection. I was like, why not let's do a video on the top three handbags in my collection? Someone asked me to do a handbags collection. I'm not there yet, but I think a video will be coming this year let's just say that but i am here today to show you all the top three handbags in my collection if you want to know what these amazing bags are girl just keep on watching so this first bag is not a surprise it is from mark jacobs I have a video on this bag, a handbag review. Y'all, it is the Marc Jacobs Snapshot in DTM. This bag to me is way less than it deserves to be priced, okay? This is a Safrona leather handbag. Y'all, I love, 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 love how sleek, I love how shiny the leather looks. And I just love the overall minimalistic look of this handbag. So I got it in DTM Black, the black on black. Have the Marc Jacobs logo right here in the front. So if you can tell, this is a very small camera style bag. I still love it. It's, it's kind of small, but girl, I still love this handbag, okay? So what I like about it, the unique design of this bag is the zippers. So if you can see the zippers, they go in opposite direction. I just think that is so cool. I don't know. Maybe I'm lame for that, but I just think that is so cool. And then girl, on the back you have this exterior pocket. So y'all, this bag is very, very structured. Again, it is in the Safriana leather. And you pretty much have two compartments of this handbag so the compartment that's on the outside when you're wearing it it is kind of small but the one that's in the back is a lot bigger and inside it has a side pocket as well if you can see so right now i just have it stuffed girl if you want to see a review on this handbag i will leave it in the cards up above but this is one of the favorite bags in my collection it's very carefree it's very versatile in my opinion you can wear it on the shoulder as a shoulder bag you can also wear it cross body let me show you all the strap that it comes with. It comes with this beautiful guitar style strap and it's very minimalistic as well. It says the Marc Jacobs. Probably can't see until I get close. But yes, it has Marc Jacobs on the strap and I don't know, I just like the sound that the straps make I'm, yeah i'm kind of weird but it's just very therapeutic to my ears if you will but let me i guess i can go ahead and put the straps on the bag so i can show y'all how it looks like i just like the clicking of the straps so this is how it looks with the strap on Y'all, I just love how shiny this bag looks. Like, this could be, to me, this could be $700, okay? So, this is the first, first top, not necessarily first, but this is one of the top three bags in my handbag collection. The Marc Jacobs snapshot dtm and girl if you're not into this like all black look on the website they have numerous of numerous numerous of colorways in this bag i was looking at the white one but will i get the white one dirty probably so i'm not sure but they have the white in dtm and to me it's gorgeous 
but this is just the DTM in black and y'all I love her and y'all in this video these handbags are not in any particular order it's pretty much what I'm grabbing first but this next handbag I did a video I think I did like a favorites video on this handbag and y'all it is from Louis Vuitton it is the Louis Vuitton multi pochette what is this called is the Louis Vuitton pochette Matisse. I said multi pochette. I think I want the multi pochette. But this is in the reverse monogram. I was thinking about going with the original monogram in this handbag, but it had the Vachetta leather here on the top handle. And I was just like, if I wanted to wear this, if I wanted to wear that handbag in the rain, I couldn't do so because I will pretty much get watermarks on the Fachetta leather. So I went with the reverse monogram. This has the black leather here on top. And girl, if you can see, I still have my sticker here on my handbag. I picked this up maybe 20, 20? I think I got this in 2020. But yeah, I love this handbag. This isn't a staff for many, but I love her for myself. So, when you open her up, you have three compartments. So, you have a compartment here in the front. You have one in the middle. And you also have one compartment here in the back. This handbag can house so much, y'all. When I say so much, so much. And the best thing about it is the bag. You have an exterior pocket in the back. I love when handbags include the back pocket or the exterior pocket. It's just more space to put more things that I don't need in my handbag. But y'all, is people still talking about this? This is an awesome handbag. It's versatile, just like the Marc Jacobs Snapshot. You can wear it as a shoulder bag, you can wear it as a crossbody, you can wear it as a top handle bag. Girl, I love her. I love her, okay? Let me show y'all the strap. It's the strap that it came with. And y'all, it is obviously removable and also adjustable. So we love a adjustable strap. But I, I don't know if people still talking about the Louis Vuitton Pochette Matisse, but baby, I am because it is a handbag that I still reach and gravitate towards to this day. Last but not least, we have sort of like a different handbag but I love this handbag it is also versatile in my opinion it is the Louis Vuitton Palm Springs Mini do y'all remember when this was like the it girl handbag like everybody wanted this bag so you have a pocket right here nothing can fit in this pocket girl I don't even try to open it unzip it because nothing can fit some people put chapstick in here I don't I just it's just for decorations for me but you have a pocket right here and then you have the inside of the bag this is a backpack i don't wear it as a backpack i wear mine as crossbody or maybe on the shoulder and y'all this also can fit a lot so i just have it stuffed but this is the inside of the bag if you can see it's pretty much black like a black hole you have a pocket in the bag i don't use this i don't know why but maybe i will start but you have a pocket right here in the back but girl y'all are y'all tired of hearing me say i love all these bags because i do but y'all clicked on this video and y'all know this was the top three handbags in my collection so what do you expect but y'all this is the Louis Vuitton Palm Springs Mini. So the straps can be a bit tricky. I'm not going to undo them on camera because I would have a hard time putting them back together. But the straps can be a bit tricky if just purchase this bag and you really don't know about the straps. But this is the straps. It kind of come with, yeah, it comes with two. And again, I'm not going to take them on loose. But I pretty much have it set for my frame. I like my handbags to kind of hit like my upper hip. I don't want them too low and I don't want them too high. So they hit just right for me. Sometimes this strap can kind of sink and dig into my shoulders. 
Mm, I wish they would have made the strap a bit thicker, but we move, y'all. I still love this bag and I would highly, highly recommend to anyone. That's pretty much it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. These three handbags are the top three handbags in my collection. I will suggest anyone, anyone to maybe check them out at your local boutiques. And yeah, y'all, that's pretty much it. I love you all. Thank you so much for tuning in. Please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Drop a nice comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video.